Okay, so this is Liberty 2. <laughs> so what we... I've just fed them the um, fodders, fodder sprouts. No, not fodder, sprout. I've just fed them the sprout. Um, and now I'm attempting to engage them in some liberty movements. But they are quite determined to not do any liberty. Oh, so much so. Okay, I did ask her to turn a bum on us. And then I'm asking him, the big one, to come this way. And the little one to move that way. <laughs> yeah, it does work. Just that I don't really like the whole concept um, of liberty. Because actually, um, you know, not that I don't like the concept. I think it all depends on who's, who's doing it and why they're doing it. You know, there's um, some folk that would do liberty and then it's actually kind of disgusting. You know, they lie them on their backs and, um, and you know, spread their feet. And I just find it's very um, offensive for a flight animal to be on its back. Um, taking the fly mask off. I actually work with these guys in, um, I do lunging with them um, and riding, but our ground is very wet after good rains last night, so I've decided to um, <laughs> to come back on Sunday with a, when hopefully the, the ground is dried and the weather is cleared. Hmm. Yeah. So, um, that's why I'm doing the liberty. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not a true libertarian, but um, I, I like the feeling of um, talking to them and having them come to me. And they do, generally. <laughs> um, I, can get, I can send two of them um, to the stable area and working with one. I can do some liberty especially with the, the youngster, she, she will do it with me, but not today. Today they just, I mean, look at the yawn, they, they just girly, 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 head up, come, let's go, step, yeah, yeah, oh, he's going to yawn again, come. That's good. Yeah, come. Come, touch bum. Touch your bum. Come, touch. I do teach him to touch. He's not listening to me. Somebody's in the background there. Come, touch ya. Oh, okay, then don't. Come, touch. Touch. Touch her with affection. You're always biting her butt. Touch her with affection. Touch her. All right, so this is just um, Wendy from Quinn Horsemanship fiddling around with the horses this morning. Um, how lovely is that? Hello, how lovely is that? This is a precious girl, this. Come a long journey. <clears throat> I don't often body work these guys. They don't really. She did when I started. She had bumped her forehead. So she had issues when I started. He had an awful road. She still got a bit of it. Um, but it was really horrendous. I must actually really work out how to add a photograph. Or make a video out of photographs and put it on. But he had a horrendous road back. It's much better. But it's, um, we've had a break from work for about two months, I think. Wait, really don't do that. Okay, Sage is always very rude. Um, she needs to be touched. So she's always very rude. Um, she's my favourite. Um, yeah, so I do sometimes do body work on, on, on him, uh, especially him. Well, I have in the past. But the thing is, like with everything, if you're working correctly with your horses, you can, um, and if you ride in, if you do the flat work in a manner, um, I want to say correctly, I'm going to leave the word correctly there. If you ride in, in, in a correct manner the um, and you're aware of the muscles that are tight, you will actually allow them to um, release those tensions while you're riding. 
So, um, like Jane Savoy says, um, proper dressage riding is physiotherapy. And um, Paige is often in this not too happy state. But she's fat though, this is probably part of the problem. But yeah, so what, um, if you ride correctly, you can, um, you can correct, um, muscle. like his roach. I mean, his roach was horrendous when I started. Um, he had been lunged previously by others, but I did the dynamic body work where I still do it with him in the lunge. So in the, in the dynamic body work, um, you allow their muscles to move, you wait for their muscles to relax. It's actually quite, quite um, astounding um, how, how that can happen. Um, you just get them, to, in the walk even, you get the muscles to start moving as they should and then the body self heals. It's one of my big things that I, as, as, a, as my body work, is that the body actually does self heal. Um, once you, if it's stuck, because if it gets stuck through emotion or tra trauma or um, excessive work or injury, they sometimes get, like we do too, in a postural state, incorrect state. So um, if we then start just doing postural correction um, exercises like yoga, pilates, um, qigong, um, <clears throat> you can even do the tai you know, all of those postural um, exercises. Then before you know it, your um, your body's gone into the correct posture. Yeah, it's nice, tall. Your spine is pulled apart. You know the the, the vertebrae. <laughs> it's like stretched up, and um, your muscles are all um, toned. It's quite astounding. And then your diet, eh? Diet needs to be. Um, it's very important to get um, enzymes and natural food. Uh, Living food, like living, yeah, living food into your system, very important. Um, well, it must be living until you eat it. <laughs> Talking about veggies, though. Yeah. Um, yeah. So, thanks for watching my faffy morning. Um, not much work, faffy morning. Um, didn't really want to say that actually watch the other YouTube channel and I say thanks for watching please like my page down below and well you can't see me so but it's um yep be blessed